Here's my final message to all of you. Basically, the reactor slash sci-fi community as a whole. I really wanted to take this opportunity to thank you all for being here, regardless if you had been supporting me or just looking around, even though I'm a lesser known member of this community. Looking back at 2016 to what I have now, it really shows how far had I come. If I were my 2016 self and my current self had told me about what I'm going to do in the future, where I go from a mediocre core game to a core game full of interactivity and whatnot, I wouldn't have believed it, but here we are. I had tried a lot of times through several cancelled projects till I eventually landed on a project that made me who I am in this community, Singularity Containment Site. Personally, I liked it better than Intelligent Builder's Computer Guru, though I was really proud of the things that I had done in its final update. Oh, didn't I forget about the incredible people that I had met along the way in this journey? There's a lot of people that I can pick from, but I guess it's the most prominent people in the community that I find From technological bite breaking games just by touching it, to elevators being a charming person in this community, to determine being a fun companion to be a side of, to Ascenzo bringing in the jokes and all that, to Astra X2 for being an inspiration with his own creations, to YT Police Force for being the first person to run Intelligent Builders slash Intoro Corporation alongside me, and of course, to all of you, who had stuck with me and my journey along the way. I can't forget about myself, who had changed a lot over the past 8 years. Every time I had released an update to Singularity Containment Site, or worked on a new core game, or met new people for that matter, it does feel like that I had added more things to my story, despite most of my games being unreleased. It's still a memento of what I used to do back then, and I'm glad to share it with all of you. It was fun to look back in history together of what I had done, and we probably did laugh at it as well. Some stupid things I had done here and there while I was young, but hey, I learned from the hard way after all. Of course, the community had matured over time, from what was a computer core community to, well, just a reactor startup community. I do miss the fun times I had with a lot of people as well, but without meeting all of you in the first place, wouldn't I be the same right now? Anyways, it's finally time for me to go. Not really sure if it does count as a retirement because I have been here for almost a decade already. I do have to say goodbye to more than half of my friends, as well as a lot of servers. Even though there are servers that I didn't bother to touch, I'll still cherish the moments that I had made over the years. My project, Singularity Containment Site, was the perfect send-off to me for the community. And I really wanted people to have fun. I'm not sure if my leaving announcement really sent shockwaves throughout the entire community, but it's still nice to see your support, despite me being kind of nervous to send it out as it's such a drastic shift in direction for me. I really wanted to do what's the best for me, and now, with my project finally in the full release, I can finally stop pressuring myself to work on the game on a daily basis. Don't worry, the game will still receive one minor update and three bug fix updates, so basically, I'm going to still fix the game from time to time for just one more year. But now, it's time for me to focus on life and stuff that really makes me happy. Once again, I gotta thank you guys, whether if you had came here because of my music or because oh of my the no. site, or maybe through other sources. I'm glad that you guys had stuck around. There's some people that may have a grudge on me and whatever it is, I do apologize for whatever that I did led to that in the first place. Not everyone likes me of course, maybe it's jealousy or maybe I did something wrong and it's fine. Don't get me wrong, the reactor community also did change my life in the process and while I'm leaving the community for good, there's a very low chance that I would come back after seeing everything that happened, but for the time being, I'm happier outside of the community and finally getting to do the things I, I wanted to do. I'll also take a break from the internet for god knows when, but eventually I'll return one day, maybe later this year. 
This has been Don't Look 2, and I'll see you on the other side.